So the question is, are you ready to invest a little bit of time into your creative dream? I believe you are. This video is for all the people who think they don't have enough time to chase their dream, photographer or not. After I left the journalism industry, I needed to regroup and refocus my passion for storytelling. From 2018 through 2019, I would casually take a photo here and there, which would only remind me of how important visual storytelling is to me. Then COVID-19 hit and that woke me up. Just before Arizona locked down in March of 2020, I would take short walks around my neighborhood first thing in the morning. So the bug to take control of my day had already bit, and I formulated a plan. On these early morning strolls, I obviously noticed how beautiful the light was. I'm still most interested in night photography, but early morning photography is a close second. Throughout the COVID pandemic, I was fortunate enough to retain my employment, and every morning I would spend 10 to 20 minutes before my workday started taking photos. But full disclosure, I've always been a morning person. <laughs> <laughs> the truth, I am not a morning person. But because of the simple life hack, I'm kind of becoming an early bird. But let's do some math. That will explain my case. Most people I know work 50 hours per week for their day job. That's 3,000 minutes. Now, if you decide to start your day taking street photos for 10 minutes, that's only 50 minutes per week. That's less than 2% of the time you spend at your day job. And the COVID-19 wake up call for me was that it forced me to spend at least 10 minutes doing exactly what I love. Fast forward to today, I now enjoy losing a little bit of sleep because I'm chasing my dream. And the people I've met along the way have been fantastically supportive and really fun to interact with. So thank you. Until next time, I'll see you in the streets. What the fuck?